Hey guys, Gravender here. What's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Marvel Contest of Champions. And if you were watching the live stream earlier, I told you guys I was going to be doing my end of the Alliance Quest week crystal opening today. And that time has finally come because we did get our rewards from the Alliance Quest placement. Fifth place in Gifted. Fifth place. That's, that's absolutely amazing to me. We got one tier 4 class catalyst crystal which it really doesn't matter what we end up getting out of that to be honest um i know what the next character we're taking up is i said that in the live stream as well thor will be the next character that i take up to rank five uh but we do get two tier 4 basic catalysts so i am one tier 4 basic catalyst away from being able to take uh thor up and we do get uh, an alpha catalyst uh, 3600 tier 4 basic catalyst fragments and we get to move up into superhuman so we'll be back up there again hopefully we'll get enough in there this time to be able to rank we have been eight spots out the past two weeks from being able to rank in superhuman um so it kind of stinks but it's not a bad place to be in either i mean coming in just eight places i mean it's 58th overall in uh, superhuman so it's it's not terrible but obviously it could be a lot better you know if we went eight spots up so hopefully we do i don't know but we've got 135 crystals obviously some of those are three uh, are the free free crystals so we're not going to be opening those free crystals up but we are going to be opening up everything else uh arena boosts and we'll go ahead and pop those i think most of everything is probably going to get uh popped open I don't think I'm going to really spin anything out, so should be a pretty decently short video, I would think. Not exactly very, very long. Cut three of the War Victors crystals. I'm going to keep those for just a little bit. Those aren't exactly the worst crystals in the world. Cut map three crystals. Wait, well, you know, it could, it would be nice. It would be really nice if we got some fragments out of these for the tier four uh, basic, and at least enough to uh, to form. A T4 basic because then that means we will be a lot closer to getting Thor. Uh, we've got one premium hero crystal. We'll save that for just a second. Let's go ahead and pop open these gold crystals. Love me some gold crystals. We are definitely in the uh, the clear as far as how much gold we have uh, to be able to take Thor up. We've got six two star crystals which could potentially give us uh, some max six stones we've got one two and we got two out of that which I mean we could get some more out of the premium hero crystals hopefully we get a four star out of the premium hero crystal that would be ideal not not just the one we've got some more over uh, over in the other section but let's go ahead and open up these quest crystals Let's say get some units out of that would be sweet. I've got units out of these quest crystals before. They can mysteriously spawn those. It'd be kind of nice if they did, but we didn't get that today. Let's check out and see what we can get as far as these crystal shard crystals go. 400 premium hero crystal shards. And I think that about, yeah, we've got six daily crystals. Pop those open. That's not too bad. I'll take it. I mean, it's not like the best thing in the world, but it could be absolutely worse. We could have actually just just got uh, only one stars. So we did manage to pull something that was actually a little bit useful. Let's, uh, I think now we are, we are about done with those kind of crystals. So let's go over here. Let's open up three of these lesser solo crystals. Let's grab those. Pop those open. Yeah. If I needed the XP, it wouldn't be that bad, but I don't really need it. And we got, I think, three of these as well. So we got three of the greater solo crystals, which have a potential to house much better stuff. These are okay. The arena boost for the four stars, I'm okay with those. That's not that bad. A three star awakening gem, I can actually use that, so it's not awful. Uh, four star would have been absolutely insane to pull, but you know the likelihood of that happening is probably one in a million. Um, 
far as this game goes. Let's go in here and get this premium crystal. Two star Iron Man. And we do get another Max Sig ability crystal. I'm going to pop the three star that I've got over here. Two of them. Actually, I've got two. Pop those open. See if we get a new character that we didn't previously have. Stuff starts to load slow, but no. But we do get a Max Sig crystal for a three star. And we get a three star rank up package, which we do not want because it's a waste of money. And we're going to pop over here. And we have. 20 some odd premium rare crystals. We'll see how many we got in the end here all together. So we have 24 premium hero crystals. So let's pop these open. See what we get. A civil warrior. Cool. I did not have him as a three star, so I will take that. I mean, I'm going to take him regardless uh, of what we end up getting. Uh, if I do get three stars, I would much rather get um, either new characters or, well, I mean, it's the only option I got is new characters or to awaken them, but I would prefer to get uh, awakened characters already. That way I get the four star crystal shards. We ended up with two more, so that does give us some shards. And it looks like Wolverine is maxed out. I don't know for sure if Iron Patriot is. I don't think he is. He is not. He is. Oh, now he is. Okay. So Iron Patriot is. And we are getting a ton more of the uh, Max Sig Crystals. Open four more. So 24 crystals. And we ended up with three, three stars. So, as far as I'm concerned, those odds are really, really terrible. Um, probably not as bad as they probably could be. I mean, we did end up getting at least one in every every ten. Um, if we were to open up, you know, 30 crystals, so that wouldn't have been too awful. But it's still kind of crappy as far as drop rates go. And it's been so long since I pulled a four-star uh, four from... Uh, from anything like that so that does kind of suck We've got 16 of these max sig crystals pop those open should be all three star shards and it is be form enough for another three star we did i'm gonna pop that open see if we get another max sig crystal and we do thankfully i waited i like to wait now just to make sure because I'd, I'd rather open up all of the same crystals at the same time as i can and we are a little under a thousand away from the next four star crystal and we have three of these max sig crystals so we're going to pop those up and see what happens 165 not really anything out of the way that i was i was thinking that should put us at 170 yeah 173 on the four star crystal shards so we're looking pretty good maybe two more wars uh, if we can win them, that's the problem. Like I said earlier in the live stream, we are at like rank 15 in uh, Alliance Wars right now. So it's going to get a little bit more difficult. So let's pop these. That I like. That, that I like. I can add that on to uh, my Scarlet Witch. It's only one, but still yet. We're getting her closer to, to 20, so... Overall, not not exactly the worst pool in the world. I like that. It, I'd rather get that than just get loyalty. So now we already know we are guaranteed a tier four out of this. So we're going to spin this one out and see what we get, and uh, then we'll pop open all of those Alliance Quest Map Five crystals that we have. Because, like I said, this is a guarantee. If we get anything out of the other one, it's going to be purely. Um, Purely luck. Ooh, I wish it would have stopped on that Mystic, but I'll take a tech. Like I said, it's not really going to hurt me either way on whatever I get here now. At this point. I think I'm back to like one tech though. So Now we got 26 of these map 5 crystals. Let's see what we end up getting. Not getting a full one out of 10. 20. No fools out of 20. 
16 overall or 26 overall and no full ones formed but we did get uh, tier 4 basic catalyst fragments 14,275 so that does help out big time we'll go over and take a look at my tier 4s right now I'm pretty sure those 25 that's left yeah those are all free crystals so we're not going to mess with any of that but let's go take a look at my inventory see exactly what we got going on now as far as tier 4 catalysts go so let's go into tier 4 so we're not too far off actually from uh, forming another tier 4 basic I wish I would have got enough shards to actually do that oh I ended up with three okay I didn't realize I had <laughs> I didn't realize I had two uh, tier 4 tech catalyst but apparently I do so we're at three now so we have the possibility of getting a mystic or not mystic but a cosmic or a tech for the next rank up I mean I really want to do Thor I do because I don't think I have any other uh, techs that are really that great other than Star Lord oh Jesus Christ Star Lord oh my god I, I forgot completely about Star Lord I don't and that's that's something you probably don't ever hear somebody say either is oh my god I forgot all about Star Lord but I didn't even think about that so so it's between Star Lord and Thor now Jesus Christ oh I don't know now now I don't know oh holy crap you guys let me know. Let me know in the comment section down below. What do you guys want to see? Do you want to see Star-Lord or do you want to see Thor? Because I am absolutely torn now. I am torn again. I don't I don't know. I don't know who to take up next. So, comment section down below. Star-Lord or Thor? Tell me, tell me guys. Because this will be our next rank 5. Both of them are such awesome characters. They really are. But I, I just feel like maybe a, a rank 5 Star Lord would be so much more uh, useful than a rank 5 Thor. And then I sit and think, well, maybe a rank 5 Thor would be way more useful than a Star Lord. I don't know. I don't know. This is a conundrum again. This is absolutely a conundrum. Let me know in the comment section down below. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video and this is your first time watching the channel, please consider leaving a sub on it. If you enjoyed the video itself, please leave a like on it. As always, guys, remember to like, share, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you in the next one. Later.